common complaint with the Apple Watch is that your exercise and your movement for your activity aren't tracking like you think they should. This is how you can fix some of that activity tracking problem with your iPhone and your Apple Watch. I'm Josh Smith with GottaBeMobile.com and there's a couple things that you need to do. The first thing you wanna do is go into settings and then go to privacy. Tap on location services, make sure they're turned on, and then scroll all the way to the bottom and tap on system services. From there, you're going to want to make sure that motion, calibration, and distance are turned on, which they are. Now, if that's set up, the next thing you're going to want to do is go out and you're going to want to do a 20 minute outdoor walk. And you'll want to do this with your iPhone with you. And if you don't have time for a 20 minute walk right now, you can do this over a period of several walks. This is gonna calibrate the Apple Watch to your movement. That way you're going to have more accurate data tracking. Now, if you've already done that and your activity isn't being tracked accurately, you may need to reset that. So on your iPhone, go ahead and open your watch app and you're going to look for the privacy option right here. We're gonna tap that. And then you're gonna to wanna to tap on reset fitness calibration data. And when you do this, it's going to basically wipe the calibration data that's already been stored, whether that's from an older watch or from your new watch that you've gotten. And you're gonna to have to redo that, which means going on that 20 minute walk. So it takes a little bit of time. It's not a one second fix, but after that 20 minute walk and after this reset, you should be experiencing much better activity tracking. And that should follow through and you should be able to see that on your activity both in the movement track and the exercise track. Now you can also install Apple Watch updates if you haven't already done those because there are fixes that will make both of these more accurate. Thanks for watching our how-to on the Apple Watch and you can check out more in the link below. And if you found this useful, please don't forget to like, leave a comment letting us know what you wanna hear about the Apple Watch, what you wanna learn how to do, and subscribe if you want more about the Apple Watch, iOS, and other technology that we cover.